cheap beer for you to drink. This is uh, the moment we've been waiting for. And uh, I believe a tweet was sent from you that said, but we need to do a collab when this drops. Yeah, but that was, like, I thought it was like an April Fool's joke because it it seemed different. It, I remember the, the original tweet said it was going to be 14%. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and it didn't look like this. It was yeah. like a different styled can. Yeah. But it, it's actually real. Only this flavor, though, not the sour Yeah, they had like ass. a list of flavors as uh, well. But uh, it actually exists. Garrett from AgroPool, by the way. Hi. Um, and, uh, yeah. It's a, a Wednesday night, and we're going to drink yeah. more than itself. Just because <laughs> we just got this like 30 minutes ago, and I'm very excited to try it. Yeah. So uh, before we dig into the Four loco Black Cherry Hard Seltzer, 12% alcohol, by the way, in a 25-ounce uh, can, I mm -hmm. think. Mm -hmm. uh, what seltzers have you had, and what's your favorite one? Uh, I've had White Claws. I've had Trulies and uh, the natural light ones and I also got one at Aldi I don't know is Aldi a like a regional thing no I think they're well they had their own called like Vista Bay I've seen that and those are really bad were so, they okay. yeah they they uh they were really bitter it's 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 hard to explain it was like a normal seltzer with a like a really bitter sour fruit flavor at the end doesn't sound good. It was not. No. I've seen those at the checkout every time I go to Aldi. I was wanting to try them. Yeah. But you just saved me like 15 <laughs> bucks. So you're, what's your favorite? Like White Claw? Yeah, I think White Claw does the balance of like a, a fruity sweetness with like a light, crisp flavor of the seltzer. What's your favorite White Claw flavor? Uh, I like Black Cherry a lot. Okay. And well, I also... I want to say Black Cherry and Raspberry the best ones. Ah, raspberry's the one I thought I would really like it because I like raspberry flavored stuff. I don't know. There's something about that raspberry. I thought I would like mango and because I like I mangoes in yet. general. It, it's not good. Like it smells like an armpit when you open it and it just doesn't taste great. That explains why it's not in the variety pack, I guess. <laughs> it's not good. You have to buy it in its own separate pack and it's just disappointing. Yeah. Ah, yeah. Well, I, I'm a big fan. If you watch the channel, you know I'm a big fan of the Natural Light Seltzer. The Aloha Beaches is probably the best one. And that's 6%. This is 12 and it's in a tall boy can. So this is like five light beers. Yeah, that's definitely the strongest <laughs> seltzer I've seen. Definitely. And uh, we're going to see if it's any good. 23.5 fluid ounces. That's the size. And 12% alcohol. Let's try it out. I'm going to pour mine into this glass and you can just have the can you and can just top that we're at my apartment by yeah. the way so i can just kind of waddle over to bed yeah. afterward <laughs> or maybe just hold on to that. i mean that's like a weekend's worth of do, yeah. do you like normal floor four locos i do really i used to hate them uh back when i was 21 years of age and drinking legally and uh they Tasted like cough medicine, mm -hmm. and I did not like them. And uh, recently, these past like two years, I've I've come on strong to them. It's like two dollars for a can, and yeah. that's all you need to drink for a night. I haven't went back and tried them yet, so. And they're doing new flavors. Like they got one that tastes like Swedish fish, and one that's like sour apples. And so it's getting better. I think so. Okay. I think so. They're on the rise. <sighs> Even though they changed the formula and people are still upset about that. About the no caffeine? Yeah. That was just, like 10 years ago. Just drink an energy drink at the same time. Yeah. You'll be fine. And the bar puts like Red Bull in all the drinks. Like what's the difference? Yeah. Okay. I don't get it. This smells like a Four loco. This does not smell like a seltzer. It does. I'm scared. Black Cherry <laughs> Four loco Seltzer. Here it is. That still tastes just like a yeah, like a four loco. I mean, it's a little, it's a little more mellow tasting than a four loco, but it's still very strong. It's like a four loco with half the sugar in it. Yeah, it's like um, sort of like a a diet version. Yeah, yeah. Like the closest I can think, like if you drink a Mountain Dew, then immediately after drink a diet Mountain Dew, it's like that separation. Yeah, yeah. I can see that. It's almost just like a regular Four loco that they didn't add a shit ton of dye in. Yeah, it's clear. <laughs> it's per it's like a crystal Pepsi. Yeah. 
This, I don't know. Do you like it? Mm. It's not bad for a Four Loco, I guess. It has the same aftertaste as the, uh, the White Claw Black Cherries. It's kind of sweet. It, uh... You, you, you definitely feel the alcohol in it. Um, yeah. But it's... It's still very heavy in flavor, like, when you first take a drink. And mm -hmm. I notice that with other seltzers, like, you drink it and it just tastes like seltzer water and then the flavor comes in. Yeah. And this is just like drinking a juice, drinking like a, a normal Four loco. Yeah. You know what? The more I have of it, the more I don't mind it. It's, it's definitely more mellow than a normal loco. Do you see yourself ever getting it again? Yeah, I I would for sure drink this again. It's uh maybe if they have new flavors, I might try those. But uh, yeah, I would definitely buy this again. It's only like you still have a price tag on the yeah. can. It was only a dollar ninety nine with tax. Uh, it's not bad. It's not. Um, I feel like it needs ice. I mean, it, it's yeah. been in the fridge and it was cold when yeah, I bought them. Like the can, it like it has condensation on it. It's pretty cold. Yeah. Um. But also, I did notice that a normal Four loco, when you first take a few drinks, they're kind of like like pungent. You have to power through them for a little mm -hmm. bit. And this just goes down smooth. It does. This, you can just sip on this. This is good. It is. Um, it, I don't know. If you're a fan of White Claw and you go to this, if you haven't had a Four loco before, you might not like it. But yeah. if you've experienced Four loco and you don't mind them, this is actually kind of enjoyable. If you if you're a fan of both worlds, yeah. this is just like the Van Halen album best of both worlds. <laughs> this is like drinking Van Halen. Did you see the Billy Eilish doesn't know who Van Halen is and everyone's freaking out? Yeah. Yeah. That's not surprising. What, no, she's she like, 17. Yeah. When's the last time Van Halen's been in the news? Not in a long time. Yeah. So, yeah. But um okay. Yeah. This is not bad. I was expecting it to, I don't know, be better. Yeah, I was expecting a more... I don't know. I, I was expecting more of an experience of it. Yeah. It just tastes like a like a stronger seltzer. Yeah. Um, I don't know. I'm, I mean, I'm down for it. I'm here for it. Because, like, a White Claw tall boy is, like... 250 at the gas station. Yeah, so this is not only cheaper, but... Stronger. That's 5%. And I think yeah. it's a smaller can. And yeah. This is twelve percent and yeah, a little bit bigger. I I don't know what size this is. Twenty three point five. And I think the White Claw Tall Boy is like twenty two or I yeah, something it. like that. Yeah. So yeah, I would recommend it. You might not like it. Uh, it's not as easy drinking as a White Claw, or even the Natural Light Seltzers. But worst case scenario, I mean, you're out two bucks. So. Yeah. Exactly. You know, because they don't sell these in packs. You have to buy a single one. Yeah. Yeah. All right, this is a uh, cheap beer for you to drink. Uh, the Four Loco Hard Seltzer. I was promoting another video in the last one because I planned on doing it. Have you seen the Boss Drink Like a Boss uh, drinks? They yeah. look just like this, but okay. That'll be the next video because I, I, I said that was going to be the next one, and then this kind of just popped in between. Yeah, I'm excited. But, uh, yeah, it's like 14% uh, alcohol. It looks just like a Four loco tall boy can, 99 cents. Wow. Very scary to try. <laughs> but uh, that'll be the next video. This was a, a pleasant surprise. We found the Four loco Hard Seltzer. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, if you're new to the channel, like, subscribe. We'd love to have you here. We do videos like this all the time. Again, Garrett with AgroPool, like his channel, and uh, cheap beer for you to drink.